This story is new at 6 o'clock now. A Lake Oswego teenager may be the youngest iPad application creator in the world. K2's Melika Johnson joins us now from Lake Oswego High School, where this young software engineer goes to school. Melika? Yes, Stephen Deb, this kid, he is a genius. We talked to his parents, and they say they're just normal computer users. They're totally blown away by what their son has done by creating this application, and they're even more amazed that he did it without any help. The thing that kind of frustrates me is I'm totally into computers, and I have to carry around this huge, heavy backpack. Rather than groan like most teens, 16-year-old TJ Pluachek decided to do something about it. I'm just surprised that nobody actually thought about this. TJ is the creator of an iPad application called Notelook. It goes beyond Apple's Notes app, which is also found on the iPhone. They're kind of like the big pile of mail that you have sitting up uh, like in the kitchen where where Notelook is like the file cabinet. Notelook lets you type and organize notes the way you would a notebook. I've already added in a couple other notes. TJ may be the youngest creator of an iPad application in the world, and he doesn't even have his driver's license. I just want people to use it because it's functional, not because of my age. TJ taught himself how to create software by reading books. He then spent six months and his entire spring break developing Notelook. There were certain times, actually, when I was developing this application that I just said to myself, I want to stop doing this. I just want to get out of software development right now. This is way too above me. But those notebooks kept weighing on his mind. We have this modern technology, so why are we not using it? Students at Lake Oswego High School, where TJ attends school, often stop to ask him about his app. Most of them, they just ask, how in the world do you do it? And my simple answer is, well, you uh, work like 24-7 for about five to six months and you can do this. If only they sold that kind of perseverance in the app store. The thing is if you put your mind to it and you never give up, this is possible. TJ's app costs 99 cents. He makes 70 cents for every app that is purchased. He won't tell us how much money he's made so far, but he says he will be happy if he can just make enough to feed his computer habit. Live at Lake Oswego High School, Melika Johnson, K2 News.